What's poppin' y'all? Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we're taking a look at Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Squishies. Um, if you did not know, I did the daycare intro. But with recently playing this again with my girlfriend and us both enjoying it, both of us getting scared, well, my, me mostly getting scared, her getting scared of me jumping around like an absolute lunatic because I am scared, uh, we have squishies, and squishies have had a rise and a fall, and they are resurfacing again because they have so many different brand deals. Before, they just used to make different, like, ice creams, animals, just, you know, they were a big phase, it was similar along the lines of fidget spinners, bottle flipping, and then squishies, it was the next big thing in, like, um... Trends. Uh, I think it came out just before slime, uh, because the slime sort of followed it through this. And, um, yeah, they are now teaming up. They have renamed themselves. They're not squishies. They're, like, squashies or something now. And, um, they've rebranded, and they have a load of different collaborations. They have Sonic. They have My Little Pony. They have Kirby. They have Pac-Man. They have Mario. And they have Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach. You can get these for around... 10 to 12 pound and you are paying more so for the brand than the actual squishy because they did used to be a lot cheaper they used to be five or six pound before and now they are obviously 10 to 12 and that is because of the brand like if you had two of the exact same hoodies slap a nike logo on it that one will be more so you're paying for the five nights at freddy's brand and here is freddy fazbear yes i did feel up the packets because these are blind bags and i did decide i wanted freddy and i wanted monty monty's already up on the channel so you can go watch a review on that but here is my review on Freddy. I think he's very cool. He's a lot more detailed than Monty, and he has a lot more unique of a shape. He has his little top hat, his ears. He has the little lightning bolt going down on his torso, just underneath his bow tie. Obviously, they are printing on top of, like, this foam, this sort of really squishy plastic. So they can't have too much detail. And the detail comes off anyway, because the more you squish it, the more it rips, the more it cracks, the more it breaks. So the more you use a product for its intended purpose, the more it'll break. Which I don't understand that, but oh well. Um, and here is Freddy. Uh, he is my favourite character from the game. Uh, way to go, Superstar. He's just so sweet, so wholesome, and you just love him. Um, and I'm so glad I got him. There is uh, other characters you can get. You can get uh, Freddy, Monty, Roxy. Uh, well, Roxanne, I think she's called. Chica, Vanity... Uh, that's it. There is also a secret one, which is a golden f version of Freddy, and I'm not sure if I have that one or not, because they look very similar. Um, but the ba the barcode on the back is slightly off-putting. It's very annoying. That I wish they put it on the bottom rather than on the back, because uh, it is very distracting when it's on the back. But overall, I still think it's a really cool little squishy thing. Um, it serves its intended purpose. It is very squishy. Uh, it's got a lot of detail compared to Monty, and it looks more like Freddy than Monty looks like Monty. So I do like this one, um, and I'm quite happy with it. Um, I don't justify the price, though. It is more of like a three quid sort of product than a 12 or 10 pound product. You can get this from B&M Home Park. It's pretty much anywhere that sells toys. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed this YouTube video. See you all next one. Have a nice day, and goodbye. Stay home and stay safe. It is kind of cool. I do kind of like it.